It's scenes like these the brook is hoping to prevent. Donkeys suffering under the burden of overweight tourists, horses pulling heavy carriages in difficult and often dangerous conditions. This is the ancient city of Petra in Jordan. The temples draw thousands of visitors every year, and donkeys and horses are used to taxi tourists across the difficult and steep terrain. But their fate is often overlooked by the tourists paying to use them. The animals end up exhausted after long, hard days, with some tourists insisting the owners drive faster and faster. The owners depend on tourism for their living, but when tourists barter down the prices, owners sometimes don't earn enough money for feed or good quality saddles. The Brook has just published a new code of conduct for tourists, and with the code come these pictures, graphic examples of bad practice, like two adults on one donkey and heavy people taking rides. The Brook hopes the new code will encourage tourists to approach the hire of donkeys and horses with far more care and thought. Large people should select bigger and stronger animals or not ride at all, only one person at a time. Only select an animal in good condition and always pay a fair price. The Brook also recorded conditions at Luxor in Egypt where a carriage ride is the most popular way of getting around. But many of these carriage horses are in poor condition. A big problem is crude and badly fitting harnesses. Brook vets face a constant battle to treat festering sores and open wounds. The Brook's new code aims to prevent this suffering. It's confident that tourists around the world will adopt the recommendations and help spread the Brook's mission. Healthy working animals for the world's poorest communities.